is Jamie, a Dunlop Co. I am a mom of three daughters and I run a lifestyle and parenting blog called Styling the Inside. The philosophy behind styling the inside is to style the inside of your life. So I really like to focus on positive uh, mental well-being. So the inspiration behind styling the inside really stemmed from having three daughters. Because I struggled so much as a youth and even a child with anxiety and insecurities, as soon as I had my daughters, I thought to myself, I do not want them to go through the same thing. Our mental well-being, it's, it's just so imperative to have positive well-being. I've always loved writing and I kind of just put that together with my background in early childhood education. I just figured, you know what, I'm going to start writing. But one of my first blog posts was actually about raising confident daughters. Last year, I went through a phase in my life where I wasn't feeling like myself again. Part of this whole styling the inside journey for me has really been for myself, and I guess it's just been inspiring to others because it's relatable. We all go through stuff, we're all human, and as I was going through my stuff, I realized, you know what, I'm not mentally feeling like myself, my confidence was slipping a bit and I knew I needed to move again. Exercise was non-negotiable for me in the past. I ran in a half marathon, I always worked out and I kind of stopped because I started putting everything else before me and it didn't feel good. In November, I decided, you know what, that's it, I need to move. So I went into my basement and I started doing my Jillian Michaels workouts again. You may have seen them on my stories if you follow me, my Instagram stories. Once I started, I just realized how therapeutic it was and how it was such a great release. And the the thing is, is none of that had to do with my weight or my body and it had everything to do with my mind. I have a lot of people ask me, so like styling the inside, like I love that, but what does that really mean? We are not our body inside of us. We all have a soul and our soul is really who we are. And if we could just really tune into that, especially into our intuition, that is our compass. That's our guide. When we're losing sight of that, we do things probably based on what other people want and we're not being really in tune with, with ourselves. So styling the inside for me is really going in on a deeper level and just getting to know yourself. Once you get to know yourself, I think that everything else falls into place. Day to day with my family, mornings can be a little bit of a ruckus. Getting my seven year old to school on time doesn't always happen, I have to be honest. We do our best. My girls aren't too busy with extracurricular activities, but they are. Um, my oldest is in musical theater and she just recently got her first part-time job at McDonald's. My middle daughter, she loves to play field hockey and she's played rep basketball and my youngest plays soccer. And uh, if you guys do follow me, then you know that she loves to dance. She isn't in dance, but she's just a free spirit that loves to just move. She actually teaches me so much about myself. She's so confident and it just teaches everyone around her to just, just be this outgoing, I don't know, she's just kind of like everyone's spirit animal. <laughs> I love that about her. Our weekends are usually full because of their activities and things like that, but I don't want them to be too, too busy. Going back to styling the inside of your life, you need moments of stillness. Kids need that too, because then they can go in at a younger age and get to know themselves. And I always think to myself, if I had more moments of stillness when I was a child, I probably would have known myself on a deeper level. My husband and I have been together for probably about 17 years. We celebrated our 10 year wedding anniversary last August in Hawaii, which was amazing. We wanted to go to Hawaii because of that episode of Full House when they go to Hawaii and swim with the dolphins. He's my soulmate, he's my life partner. When I had my first daughter, Jada, I was 19, just shy of 20. And I mean, and that's just how far, how fast time has gone by. And when I look back on, you know, having her so young and how Charles and I have done this together and been on this life journey together. It's just, it's pretty special that we've made it this far and he really is my soulmate. Styling the inside has really evolved over the past couple of years. I think that some people sometimes don't really understand vlogging as a business because it's still quite new. It's my purpose-driven business to help people style the inside of their life. I share my stories, my personal stories, and through storytelling on my blog, I think that that's the biggest way that people take away how to style the inside of their life. You know, it's quite vulnerable sometimes, the things that I share. It's not always easy. Sometimes I, I write a post and I hit the keyboard and I hit publish and I go, crap, that's kind of scary. It's a bit vulnerable. But then when I get a message from someone that's like, thank you so much for writing that because that really helped me. That takes me back to my why and the purpose. 
Anybody that wants to embark on something that's purpose-driven or just business in general, it really is take the first step. When I wrote my very first blog post, it was from my phone. I don't know what iPhone it was at the time. It was like four years ago. I knew I just wanted to write. I went into the notes on my phone and I just started writing from my heart. I didn't know anything about the whole setup of a blog or anything like that, but I just did it. I wrote the post. I set up a little, you know, free WordPress thing. I just started. I just took the first step. I didn't let any negative self-talk tell me that I couldn't do it or that nobody wanted to read what I had to say because I did it for me. So I loved working with I Like Her Style Vancouver on this issue. Honestly, I thought that they were just going to ask me to contribute because I love writing so much. And then when they asked me to be the cover girl, I was just in disbelief. I'm like, really? Me? I just feel so grateful to be a part of this. You know, my true passion is that everybody, each and every one of us, can just really align with our inner self our soul and and I think that when we get to that place um, it just it leads to, to happiness